Welcome back everybody. Today is February 20th and I am a short sleeve shirt riding today. It is uh, 78, 80 degrees. It is an absolutely phenomenal, phenomenal temperature wise day. I mean this is a uh, can't get much more perfect than a day like today to go for a nice little ride. But I hear we're supposed to have an ice storm tomorrow night or the night after, so you know, springtime in Ohio. So I rushed out of work, had to get some stuff done before I could go for a ride. And now I'm trying to figure out where I need to ride or where I'm going to ride. It's still on the cool side when you tuck behind these hills you can feel all the cold air funneling down. Um, you know just because the sun hasn't heated everything up yet. It's, it's heated this area up but once you get in the little valleys it's, uh, it's going to be a lot cooler. So I, I have my jacket with me because I took it to work. You know, I didn't know how to, to dress this morning because I haven't ridden in, in these temperatures for quite some time. So I have plenty of gear to uh, keep me warm if I'm out that late. You know, I just I need to figure out where I'm going. Um, it's extremely windy today gusts are up to 40 miles per hour which you know it puts a little damper on it but uh 80 degrees it is 80 degrees in February I, I live I live for days like this and I'm on a beautiful little two-lane road I'm heading down to a little town called Sugar Grove where I am going to pick up uh, US 33 or State Route 33, whatever they call it. And uh, I think I'm gonna head down to Athens. Um, I can take the back way in and shoot down 56, which is an amazing ride. Welcome back everybody. So I've uh, I've made it to uh, the start of my ride, we will call it. Um, this is one of my favorite, favorite roads. Uh, getting here can be a nightmare though. Um, I have to come down 664, which is a road almost like this. Not quite so curvy. And everybody and their mother likes to come down through here doing uh, 20 miles below the speed limit. But I have made it and I am headed south toward Athens. So I got up this morning like normal, went to work, grabbed my lunch, grabbed the helmet, grabbed my air hawk, grabbed my wallet, walked out the door and I thought for sure I put my air hawk on the seat threw my lunch in the frunk for those of you that don't have spiders the frunk is the front trunk and uh, headed to the gas station where uh, I pumped my five gallons of gas and uh, headed off to work got to work realized I did not have my uh, my name badge to get into work and uh, when I got to work, I thought cars were slow. Holy moly. Um, when I got to work, I noticed I also didn't uh, show up with the air hawk. So, uh, shot a wife a text really quick. You know, asked her if I left it in the house and, uh, you know, of course it's not in the house, it's not outside, so I get to order a new air hawk. Of 
which sucks, but it could be worse. We're 30 miles per hour. We're doing 30 miles per hour. There he goes. Woo woo. So I'm super excited. Today was uh, YouTube's cutoff for me to get to a uh, thousand subscribers, and uh, we did it. Plus twelve. So I'm I'm very excited about that. You know, and hopefully this spring I can do a little bit more with the channel. You know, I, I didn't even, uh, a little history about the channel. Um, I started it in 2012 and did absolutely nothing with it. Uploaded maybe 10 videos, hoping to share with family. And it wasn't until uh, last year, about this time, I've had the channel a year now. Um, I went out and bought an action cam, I just rushed it and I was like, oh, you know, I get one of these $60 Amazon action cameras, I'm going to be me a YouTube star. Well, I never thought I was going to be a star. Um, so, I, you know, I get the action camera and I realized that you can't even hook a mic up to it. So I was like, yeah, you know, that's fine, you know, I'll just, I'll go out and just shoot some video of what I'm doing and where I'm going. You know, because that's what I want to do. I want to, I want to share my rides and, and, and how much pleasure riding gives me. You know, so I, I don't know how many videos I did with uh, no sound. I didn't edit anything. It's just raw footage uploaded to YouTube. To, uh... So I'm a year into it, you know, and I, I really enjoy it, um, you know, especially the how-to videos in my last job, you know, I was a, a district trainer, so I, I love showing people new things and, he went fast. Um, so, uh, you know, I really in, enjoy doing the how-to videos, even though they're super simple right now. Uh, you know, anytime I get feedback that, you know, I watched your video and then I was able to do front brakes on my on my spider or, you know, I accomplished an oil change that only put me back 85 bucks where the dealer wanted $450. You know, and everybody that I'm meeting, you know, through the comments, it, it's absolutely been a blast this last year. I don't know what this guy is doing. He, I mean, he is varying his speed from 50 miles per hour to 65, 70 miles per hour. Except for here, I understand this. He's got a cigar in his mouth and he's listening to some radio. You cannot beat that. You know, and I'm not sure what I'm going to do with uh, this channel in this next year. Um, you know, I'm hoping to go to a couple places. I'm, I'm hoping, um, you know, I've already talked with uh, a couple of my friends that have bikes, so I'm hoping to get a, a small group of people together. So I'm not always riding by myself, which I don't have an issue with. I, I really enjoy you know, getting away from the house and then uh, going out for a ride. So, you know, what goes with, what's going to happen with the channel, don't know yet. You know, I know I'm going to keep putting out videos of uh, where I go and, and what I discover. And, uh, you know, Can-Am spiders have a reputation that they're, they're junk. 
uh, that they're not reliable, that they're always broken down. So, you know, I can share my experiences owning a Can-Am Spider. You know, there's a lot of positives in there. I'll tell you, there's tons of negatives, too. But, um... I think that's it. I don't want to start rambling. I want to keep this short. You know, I just wanted uh, to thank everybody for subscribing to the channel. You know, and throw a comment down there for sure. Let me know what you want to see. But, you know, I'm having the time of my life, and I want to thank everybody for uh, for watching and definitely subscribing. So, I'm going to listen to some music, and I'm going to head down to Athens little college town roll through uh they call it uptown and uh i'm gonna head home so uh definitely hit the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber give me a thumbs up and uh, throw a comment below everybody take it easy stay safe and i'll see you in a couple days